Today, we're going to use a mind map to plan our story. This way, we can organize our thoughts and develop our ideas more successfully. The story plot develops around four big topics. Number one, shaping the character. Number two, setting. Number three, problem. And number four, solutions. In the book, the main character is Connie. We're going to put Connie in the middle of the mind map as she's the main character. Our first branch is called Shaping the Character. Draw a straight line and write the, those words along it. We'll then get started on our sub-branches. Connie has short black hair, she's thin, she never smiles, and she has a pouting mouth. Our second branch is called Setting. At school, Connie watches friends play with jealous eyes, and this makes her extremely unhappy. We can't have a story without a problem. Our third branch is about the problems Connie faces. Connie believes that she has no friends because she's not pretty. Our fourth branch is about the solution of the story. The solution basically solves all of the problems Connie has in the story. One night, Connie meets a fairy. She advises Connie to serve, share, and greet others at school. Our first branch is labeled Serve Everyone. Connie volunteers to tidy the classroom. Our second branch is labeled Share Things. Connie also shares cookies and extra stationery. Our third and final branch is labeled Smile and Greet. Connie smiles and greets her classmates. Let's sum up the story plot so far from the mind map. Connie was a girl with short black hair who often watched her friends play with jealous eyes. She never smiled as she didn't believe that she was pretty. One day, a beautiful glittering fairy agreed to make Connie pretty and asked her to do three things for the next three months. Connie followed the fairy's advice and in doing so, she learned to be beautiful by her actions alone. If you have more ideas, you can use an even bigger piece of paper to draw an even bigger mind map. Hopefully, you have now managed to create your own mind map based on your very own idea and story. Good luck and have fun writing your very own story!